then Yusha, A.U. Graham hopping off and him rekindling his heroic spirits back. The secretary girl, she was popping off. The amount of English that was incorporated last episode. My gosh, she was spitting. I have just such a low, just, you know, monkey tear humor for me. And her saying all the English lines in just such the funny accent just killed it. It was a fantastic episode. Now, more seriously, Makina almost dropped in, dropped in into the, you know, the inferno, the immortal furnace. Veltal shows up, saves her. Graham says Veltal has a plan. Even though everything is so rigged for Marcus, we do not have a familia, so he can't hack us. But the powers, right? The power gap. We do have a lot of, you know, subs. Maybe, you know, the faith is going to enrich Veltal's powers. But Graham specifically said he has a plan. I wonder if that's a misdirection. Let's begin today's reaction. Hacking. Hacking. Hacking the air. Air keyboard. <laughs> <laughs> he was the streams, dude. He was the streams. I wonder if he was hate. I wonder if he was hate watching or just like cackling and laughing as he was dying to those Dark Souls bosses. And he was like, "Haha, loser, Veltal, more like V E L L Demon Lord." Yeah, you watch. Yeah, he did. A million. Here's a different Marcus. Veltal is able to get people to fawn over him through his personality, his charisma. You need to force a monopoly. You need to just fucking choke people to make them worship you, bro. This is a different. <laughs> that's, that's not so funny. I'm envious that you have to play games all day, bro. All you do is fucking stream and play video games. What do you got to complain about? <laughs> He also never banned anybody, right? Oh, bro, it'd be so funny if Veltal actually banned, like, a screeching hater in chat, and it turned out to be Marcus, and Marcus, like, harbored such a grudge, like, You banned me! I can't believe you did this to me! Cap, you put them in the furnace. Wow. Wow. He actually extended a help there. Do you have any intention of joining my forces once again? That's our demon lord, man. So benevolent, so gracious. <laughs> there it is. Gilgamesh. Just blood everything. Armor's on. Okay. Are we pressing him? And we got no familiar either, so you can't tamper with that. I expect the hacker girl to hack Marcus at some point and help us out. <laughs> Me. Oh. Oh. Okay, but it's okay, he can summon more. He should be good. He should be good. So like, what do we, what do we do? Do we have to take out his familia? But it looked like his familia was also damaged there. The, fla the fire is kind of obscuring it, but if we blow his head off, he can still recover. So I don't know. Was the familia damaged or not? Hmm. Okay. Did it do anything? Nah, I think this is the only way to beat him. Because anyone with a familia, he can like do some crazy shit and hack. His familia is also very special. 
But our hacker friend, surely she will clutch and hack his, right? This shit's so OP, it just happens instantly. Brut to bomb! Brut to bomb! I wish the secretary was here saying this instead. He's just spamming blood to bomb. Brut to bomb! Brut to bomb! Brut to bomb! That's just ridiculous. How inefficient is this though? He just has to keep spamming the fucking line too. No, 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 no. Let him cook. Explosion. Boom. Nah, he'll be fine. He'll be fine. Let him cook. No arms, though. That's actually so sad. He can't ha experience any happiness. He just wanted to see Veltal like, groveling on the ground, but even this is boring now. Empty ghoul, searching for something. Veltal? What's happening? Phase 2? Phase 2? Phase 2? Are we a raid boss right now? Is something else happening? The trump card we were talking about last episode. Second person. Uh, the first must be Graham. Graham must have pushed him to this point. That's why he also said he has a plan. He's sweating. Tides are turning. Do you still wish to join me? That's crazy. He giving him another chance to go out. That's two now. He is so benevolent. Take it. Take it, bro. You've been warned. Mm. Look at your face, bro. I don't know. I think he's panicking. He's sweating. His entire cocky demeanor is gone. He doesn't believe what he's saying. Oh, Marcus. You're done, bro. Oh. Magic gone. Nullified. <laughs> Dude, this is sound like a demon lord now. Yeah, this is some demon lord laugh. Something about this is power. It's creating this like domain where he can't use magic anymore through the familiar. <laughs> Here we go. That sounds kind of kinky. I don't know. Behold, you're about to see me naked. Only Hero Graham has seen this. No one else has. Not even Makina. Only Graham has seen this. You're lucky. Phase two, phase two. What is it? Don't fucking ask oh God. Don't fucking ask it. It kind of looked like a Susana type. Like I saw the whole like skeleton back happening, some sort of monster form. But on top of that, it felt like a domain expansion too, right? It's like a domain happening on top of this creature happening. I don't know, but uh, let's see what's happening with our hacker friends. What's she up to? What's her plan? She hacking everything. Oh, these are all the different displays. Maybe we're going to show them what's happening inside of Marcus's building. 
to just humiliate him publicly. Hack all the TV displays. All alive, girl. Goodbye, VTuber again. Oh, you just replaying the VODs? Oh, you just replaying the VODs. And maybe if we... I thought they were going to, like, you know, just play what's happening in the building. But if they play the VODs and more people are like, hey, this guy's funny. Yay, more followers, more faith. You know, and then he gets stronger. Oh my god, he's so hot. Not a single hater. I was expecting someone to say, who? Who is this? Where did my VTuber go? Yo, fuck this guy. Mm. Three times then. We need more power for phase two. She gets excited, so she gets to do whatever she wants, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> A friend? <laughs> Yo, the interwebs. All different forms are also popping off with him, so it's not just a display. Funny because this bartender is the one that kind of suggests that Veltal should, you know, start streaming because we're trying to think of, like, what kind of job could he possibly get? Then he turned on the TV and the VTuber started to play. <laughs> Number one trending, baby. The faith. The cloud. What's he yapping on about? Okay. Was the bartender smiling there? Hold up, hold up, hold up. Let's go back. Let's see. Ah! There it is. He did smile. Okay, so that's good to see that, like, his suggestion helped, you know. It didn't help, but it guided him, you know. <laughs> now, bro's thinking, I made him. Lord Veltal is a fraud. I made him. That's what the bartender's thinking. <laughs> Phase two. Got way bigger, huh? Ooh, look at that design. Is that a wing aura? Yeah, this is looking like a ray boss now. Some sort of like dragon looking thing, right? He does kind of look like a Digimon, you're right. <laughs> Did he just evolve into a Digimon? I can't tell, but it looks kind of like one. More than like, I guess, a Pokemon, yeah. Oh, that's a song. My castle. Is this some... Uh, what's it called? Uh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Uh, Misfit of Demon King Academy and Anos? He needs to, like, summon his castle for his actual reality-bending sword to come out or something, right? Is there similar lore here with the Demon Lord's castle? Okay. What did you say? Why? When I chose the throne room up upside down to keep as the stage for my battle against the hero. This is it. He needs the castle to turn into this? The more I look at it, the more silly it looks, though. <laughs> it's not CGI. It, it does kind of look goofy, though. Yeah, I should have finished them when you could have. 
I love the the jaw just moving like this. It just actually looks like a Digimon, man. I let him win. Okay. It's like before. He just nullifies it. Do your thing. Brutal bomb, brutal bomb, brutal bomb. Is the familia hacked? Is it his powers? Okay. How so? <laughs> now I'm two steps ahead. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> oh, of course, guys. Proclamationless magic, of course. Uh, incantationless? He just does whatever he wants. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, yeah, well, I'm the demon lord. He basically has become the familiar? What? This form. Okay. Phase 2 is just busted. You're dead. He just wills the magic to existence. No incantations. And all that research, all that prep has basically made Veltal stronger than possible. And we are yapping. Damn, imagine that. 500 years of planning and scheming because of his insecurity. But at the end of the day, it just is used against him. Thank you, Marcus. Wow. Now you're fired. Mm -hmm. You're fired. Cancel. Alert. Spells are nullified. He's spamming again. Marcus spamming magic today is actually so funny to me. <laughs> he just explained. What do you mean, how? Dude, Mao just spent like 10 minutes explaining after turning into a Digimon. Were you not fucking listening? We've been yapping for so long. It's too late. No, no, no. It's too late, bro. No third chances. We're just in creative mode now. Anything he wills into imagination, instantly magic. Laughing man. Oh, Takashi. They look kind of cute. It's less scary, more cute. Also, imagine these kind of, you know, bugs happening. Or even like video games when, you know, AR, VR technology gets good enough. It looks like he pissed his pants because of the puddle. <laughs> this is so ridiculous, bro. Veltal again in this form is just so silly to me with this just, you know, this mouth just like opening and moving like this. <laughs> Dude it, really like, dude, it really looks like he pissed his pants because of the puddle and no, no rejoining. We gave you two chances, bro, and you said no, there is no third time. Uh-uh. No. No third time. End him. Actually, don't end him just yet. We don't have a power plan, right? Because this whole grid is powered through the Immortal Furnace. We need new, you know, battery. We need, we need new firewood. He should be it. We should put him in, 
and then we should think about a plan to have sustainable energy afterwards. <sighs> Throw him into the furnace. Yeah. <laughs> of course. <laughs> what good? What do you mean? We need more firewood, buddy. You try to do that shit to Makina, we're gonna do it to you instead. <laughs> yep. Exactly. It's the most logical thing to do. Thank you, Marcus, for your research. Yeah. I know. Do you expect me to be a good person? You think I'm a hero? I'm a fucking demon lord, baby. You get what you deserve. I don't, I don't care. Yes. Because you were shitty to my people. I don't care if this example does not matter. You're not important to me. You were shitty to my people. You deserve what's coming for you. How dare you use this argument? That name is so ridiculous. Holy shit, what a redundant name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The truth? <laughs> Brutu bomb. Why would that work? Why did it actually explode? I thought that he could cancel everything out. Now, maybe he's just taking the hit to just prove a point. And regarding this part, about how I was forced to do this, you don't know. I wonder if this is hinting at like season 2 content, because so far it feels like this story can be wrapped up in one season. If we just take out Marcus, that's probably it, right? <laughs> Ain't doing shit, bro. No. No. See? He's such a merciful lord, bro. So benevolent. He let him have that, the final offering, man. Drop him in the furnace. Oh, that whole, like, ugh. Dude, he's pushing him down the sword to, ah. Furnace time, baby. You are firewood damage that, oh my god, wow, that was fast. Holy shit, he's just dissolving that fast. All right. Thank you for the battery. I just realized that his phase two mode, like, he's just big for nothing. I thought that, like, a big monster would start moving around and doing shit, but he just kind of stood there and he's like, ho 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 ho, I am the hacker now. I can cancel everything. Magic is at will. <laughs> he just stood there. Just the mouth is moving like this the entire time. Let's meet again after your methanol. Is this like the aftermath of like life for immortals? I'm not sure. Is there a chance for Marcus to come back? This is afterlife shit, right? I'm not. Methanol sounds familiar. I forget. I feel like it's been mentioned earlier season, but uh, yeah, reincarnation, methanol revivalital. There's where it comes. So, so, so we're gonna reincarnate him. We're gonna bring him back. Maybe he can be like a good servant. That'd be actually so funny if if Marcus came back and he's just like a servant for us now or something. <laughs> yeah, the it's kind of crazy how. <laughs> Well, I don't know what the source material is like, right? Did they actually have a huge sword fight? But the Graham versus Secretary episode, there was a lot more budget there. This one was not as, I know, hyper exciting animations, but story-wise, it's very fulfilling that we got a revenge. It was more cute and silly, to be honest. Not funny. Look at those back muscles, bro. Look at that shoulder. Look at those rear delts.
Happy ending? Oh, <laughs> Makina's probably like, oh, six pack. Oh, yes. This is all planned by me. Don't get it twisted, guys. It's a wholesome moment, bro. She's using this to her advantage. She knows what she's doing. Wow. But is this love, like, beyond camaraderie? It's the strongest form of love, to say it like that. But is this, like love because she's such a worthy subject or is this romance love actually happening he did recognize something at the near end there right he realized something like is this a ship hmm? maybe he learned how to love yeah, this feels like this finale episode like what the fuck bro this is episode seven there's a little bit more there's a little bit more hold up hold up hold up hold up the ending's playing but I, the visuals here what is this Okay, just the aftermath with the ending playing. But this actually feels like the end. What if this is secretly a seven episode series and we're done? <gasps> yo! Oh my god, she's following him. These two, it's a ship. Yo, 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 th these two, bro. It's a fucking ship, bro! She's coming with us! Let's go! Jesus, Takahashi feet. Renovations? New place? Yeah, looking like we're not longer, you know, broke anymore. We can, you know, have a better place. Our new streaming setup too. Hey, look at that! New streaming setup because, you know, our place got trashed when Marcus came over. New setup. Yo, he got the fucking YouTube silver play button 100k. The gold is for like a million or some shit. Yo, you got the fucking... <laughs> Does it say something? You know, the language is like different, you know, letters. But like, it's basically the YouTube fucking plaques, man. And two flowers to represent, you know? Is, is this supposed to represent Makina and Mao-sama's newfound love beyond, you know, servant to master? I don't know, but that's today's episode of Mao 2099. And it feels like this is the finale. Like, couldn't it just end right now? The hell are we gonna do is 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. One more arc can happen, but like, what's gonna happen? Are other immortals are gonna show up? Are we going back to just slice of life, just chill? I don't know, this could just end the series right here, but for what it was worth, this episode? Obviously, you know, the animation wasn't up to par compared to last episode, but in terms of the storytelling and getting our revenge against Marcus, pretty satisfying. And yes, we did just use him as firewood as he used everyone else i think he deserved this shit don't you dare don't you dare use this argument of oh aren't you like you're not different from me if you're gonna use me but it's like nah 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 we're no white knight you know self-righteous indignant you know knight no we are demon lord we're gonna fucking throw you in there and marcus i think he's gonna come back because the meta noel thing right that was the mode of resurrection for veltal so we could have some funny moments where marcus comes back as just a servant or something and not so for me if you're still here though if you enjoyed this reaction please like the video check out the other playlist for even more content and until next time take care